Hi. <laughs> Welcome to Sam's Town Point. This is the authentic, real deal Austin. And we have tracked down, or we hope to have tracked down, Ramblin' Jack Elliott. He is an associate of Bob Dylan. In fact, he introduced Bob Dylan to Woody Guthrie. He is a living legend. He's 91 years old and he's playing here. He has been on the road for decades and he is he was a friend of Johnny Cash and so I can't wait to see him. And if you want to learn more about him, there is a there's an amazing documentary uh, called The Ballad of Ramblin' Jack. There wouldn't be no Bob Dylan without Ramblin' Jack Elliott. There wouldn't be uh, half the people that we all know and love. Nobody I know, and I mean nobody, has covered more ground than sung more songs. Say hello to my good buddy, Ramblin' Jack Elliott. I ran away, I didn't know where I was going at the time. I got a job on the J.E. Ranch Rodeo, and I've been a cowboy ever since. Bed with a woman just singing the blues. Her but then we found out he wasn't Jack Elliott at all. He was Elliot Adnipos. And we thought, wow, you don't have to be the thing that your parents thought you were going to be. Started hollering. They sang together so incredibly well. That combination was just sheer magic. I think he wanted Dylan to keep acknowledging him as his son, you know? to acknowledge that Jack had been a big influence on him. And then when Dylan broke away and totally like left your dad in the wind and ignored him, I think that was a bitter blow. And it ain't no use to sit and wonder why, But Jack was a really big influence on everybody. Rod Stewart, Mick Jagger, all those people. Other people talked about it. He lived it. Jack was a legend. I've never heard anybody that was so enchanting on subjects that I didn't give a damn about. Ramblin' Jack has himself become an American treasure. You should have taken singing lessons. Um, I'm a huge fan of Americana, as some of you may know from watching our videos. And so the point of this weekend wasn't really to make videos at the end of the day. Um, and uh, so, but it just was such a aesthetically amazing, acoustically interesting, historically fascinating weekend that I did capture some video, uh, but just some explanation. Um, I, the place that this was held, this show, Sam's Town Point, was the real deal. It is utterly authentic, as some of these pictures will show. It is like nothing you've ever seen. Uh, and if you're ever in Austin, you've got to go and check it out. And then Ramblin' Jack, he's 91, and the place was sold out and packed, and I could only stand at the back. So there's just moments. Um, but then the high point, after it was all said and done, at the end of the evening, I got a small moment to sit down with him, and, and, and we exchanged some stories. And who would have believed it? We talked about Thames sailing barges, maybe from his skiffle time in London. But it was just a magic time. So uh, apologies for the slightly disjointed nature of this video, uh, for the borrowed footage. And um, I just hope that this sets you on a path to go and discover an interesting and amazing man and story. Well, 
Will you kill me a chicken? Send me the head. You think I'm working, but I'm lying here in bed. Oh, right, right. He never worked and he never will ride, ride, ride. So we found Ramblin' Jack Elliot and he rambled and he played and he is an epic American icon. So uh, check him out and check out his movies check out his albums he is a unique piece and it was a magic yeah. evening yeah. catch him on the flip side around Reno.